persons that were arrested and released by the Border Patrol has become an extreme embarrassment for the Department of Homeland Security. It has been so embarrassing that DHS and the U.S. Attorney's Office has come up with a new policy. Simply put, the new policy makes mandatory the release without an NTA of any person arrested by the Border Patrol for being in the country illegally as long as they do not have a previous felony arrest conviction and as long as they claim to have been continuously in the United States since January of 2014. The operative word in this policy is claim. The policy does not require the person to prove they've been here, which is the same burden placed on them during deportation proceedings. Instead, it simply requires them to claim to have been here since January of 2014. Not only do we release these individuals that by law are subject to removal proceedings, we do it without any means of tracking their whereabouts. In essence, we pull these persons out of the shadows and into the light just to release them right back to those same shadows from whence they came. Immigration laws today appear to be mere suggestions. There are little to no consequences for breaking the laws, and that fact is well known in other countries. If government agencies like DHS or CBP are allowed to bypass Congress by legislating through policy, we might as well abolish our immigration laws altogether. In the absence of consequences, and enforceable laws, innocent people are hurt, criminals are rewarded, chaos abounds, and cartels re innocent people are hurt, criminals are rewarded, chaos abounds, and cartels reap huge ben financial benefits.